Me and Ron Washington on a cocaine bender. Hi, uh, yeah, what you got? Boomerangs! What's that, a boomerang? Yes, yes, yes. What's that? Hermaphrodites? Oh, you're so passionate about that, sure. Come on, go over here. Yes, sir, in the striped shirt. Muhammad Ali running over a rhino. Muhammad Ali running over a rhino just by himself, like not even in the car. Just feel like pop, 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 pop. Yeah. 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 What's that? Michelle Obama. <laughs> Me and Ron Washington on a cocaine bender. Muhammad Ali running over a rhino. Michelle Obama, hermaphrodite. And what was that other one? Boomerang. Mario. Boomerang. And then one last one, yes. Sir. No, there's so many songs about that. Yeah, what? Rubber glove! Fashion? Nah. Sure, Charles motherfucking Bronson. So it's Ron Washington and me on a cocaine bender. Michelle Obama, Ron Washington, Muhammad Ali running over a rhinoceros, a boomerang, and a hermaphrodite. All walk into a bar. Any one of them could be a perfectly good song, but fuck it, we're gonna make all of them into a song. Let's do that again. It was 1982, and you know who's down in fucking Dallas, Texas with a guy with a hairdo. This hairdo's so fucking big, and he looks as good as shit. He's got his big gold glasses on and his smile on TV and shit. Before he was the manager, he was doing damages over these quicks from the major leagues, understanding kids. And before even all he did this shit, he threw a fastball that could fucking blow past any bench with a stick. He was taking hits. He bumps, fucking soaking off a last of a strip for some fun. My goddamn man, Ron Washington, did it like this. And Nolan and I am back his ass up like your family, bitch. That's some real fucking shit. Texas represent like we forgive and forget. Like, yeah, man, we all got our time doing lines. So fucking, hey, Ron Washington still manages fine. So sit yourself in line. Take us to the World Series, maybe one, so not quite. That's what they done, son. When it won, cause we want to walk away with a big fucking ring, done. See me and Ryan Wash getting a night on fucking smoking lines all night and night. Stay with drugs, kid, unless it's funny shit. You're hanging out in 1976 with Ron Washington. Then you gotta say yes. And so you're sitting there with a plate of this beautiful shit. See the real coke is pink and it's laid out fast. And man, Ryan Washington is talking all that crap. So I look at Ron and I'm like, you're a big star. And he's like, yeah, you're just an upcoming rapper. I know who you are. It's all right. So me and Ron Washington talk all night. And he's like, hey, I got this girl. And I keep on the side. See, before she met the president and started to represent, she was dating Ron Washington. She was a specimen. You think she's a dime piece? The first lady you should have seen her in 76 with a gold bikini, baby. Yeah! Fucking picked out shit on some poxy brown wild out in a dance club quick. Yeah, her arms are toned and everyone talks at yo, but you better see them thighs when she was dancing disco. Yeah, Michelle O.B. was killing it, see, before she just got the Obama last name, Gene. You would have sworn your last name would have been Washington and she would have been standing backstage at the Rangers game. But he broke his fucking heart and she tore him all to pieces. That's the way it goes, y'all. See, cause pretty ladies break hearts. Sometimes gotta do what Ron Washington was tore up to. So he sits there and tells me the tales of lost love and about how much he loved Michelle Obama and such. How the time they went on the safari one night and they were standing out inside the belt and they saw it's like you've never seen it in your life. Rhino charging right at their feet and they're like, this is not gonna happen, we can't escape this thing. Next thing you know, appears at the show, still in the shrubs where pulling all through is Cassius Clay on display, Ali, he's running down that fucking rhino, easily see, he don't need a Land Rover or a motherfucking TV, he is the world fucking champion, knocked out of his feet. I know so hard that it's horn to cut. Moved off, fucking saw it off shit. Muhammad Ali can run down any fucking shit. Not so much today, but fucking that you were the champion, the champ all day. Just like if you were the president, you were the president for life. Muhammad Ali is champ until the day he died. So.
This is some ill fucking shit, so I'm picking rhyme, watching this brain, cause I never get this chance. So I'm sitting down there with her, and I'm like, what else, man? And he's like, dude, I'm gonna tell you the secret, man. See, me and Michelle will be on vacation down on the next to the goddamn sea. You'll be sitting there chilling, see. I got a big old hog's leg for a blunt, and I got a boomerang by my side just for fun. Little do you know about Ron Watson, he's a world class pitcher, curveball, yeah. Coming in middle for me, but he's taking out the people without the heater, he's just working the corner people. So when all of a sudden shit hits the fan, they're in Australia and like shark attack him. A great white shark comes charging at him now, he takes the boomerang out and he knocks that bitch ass out. Better than shark, try to take a bite out of Michelle Obama's arm child. Nobody fucks with Michelle's biceps. Sharon Washington killed that bitch with a fucking boomerang, bitch. And caught it in his teeth. Did a line off the fucking boomerang with ease. No fucking joke, it was the 70s. Nobody knew who that was, yo. So don't judge the thug, cause you've been killing it since 1976 and doing it for real, son. That motherfucker still does his job well, even though he did some time in some rehab, hell. Hold on one second, there was some other topics I forget. God damn it, what was the last one? The last one I did. There was one other one that I seem to skip over quick. The last one, Charles Bronson. How could I forget? Okay, I'm gonna tell you a secret to all this shit. No, I know you think you know where I'm going, go that Michelle Obama's actually hermaphrodite that you weren't even knowing, but that's not the truth. We're gonna leave that all by the side. That's good speculation. We can talk about Lady Gaga another night. Exactly how it's gonna go down, just like that. We lost the first one, took the second one with some struggle. We're coming back to Texas, we're gonna take them out of the dark. It's gonna go five and two, we're gonna lose more one, but don't lose your faith, dude. You heard it first, I predicted, I know how this works, because I'm a famous fucking rapper and I know all the scores. I almost said it with a straight face, but I fucked it up and I'm sorry, I can't even continue this live, man. I know it's not gonna happen that way, fucking A, we're gonna sweep them all with every goddamn fucking game in there. Charles Bronson in and I have a death wish for every fucking St. Louis kid. Yeah, Albert Pujols, asshole. Tony LaRusso with your fucking rose stripe ball, yo. Come in there with your shoe polished hair. You don't stand a chance for the antlers and claws, there. So try to fuck with this. I am an Orioles fan of death with the range of the second degree. And my Orioles, you can thank them now because we took the fucking Red Sox out. We didn't do anything else. 29 games back and we took the Red Sox out. Cause we ain't doing shit except ruining other people's days, that's how we live. So the Rangers can take it. Take it and fucking run. Tony ever lose their fucking ball hair, suck it, run. Come up with this fake hair dye job, gonna take anybody out, I don't care if I don't see. He's got a fucking real shit to see. Rangers gonna win in the same year the past minute, G. That makes me happy. Dallas fucking Texas, Rebels and Captain C. It's also exciting for me. I went to SMU and when I was going to school age, one game and two. Nope, not a single win under their belt, but now they fucking took out TCU. Oh man. That shit is ill for me. To watch my fucking teams all win in one week. So put your glasses to the sky. It's a good night for everybody that's living under the Lone Star ride. Represented by the wrong side of the tracks, fucking rubber gloves, setting sex in the North Hill. Good to be home. Fucking watch y'all take the World Series trophy, yo. And it better go long enough in the game for Matt Morgan and fucking Rodgers to see them play. I gotta know some people inside of my life that went to a fucking World Series game and watched this happen, right? So, if I'm not here, I'll be on the TV watching this fucking thing, screaming on goddamn me. Go Ron Washington, go Texas. It's good to see you in this shit. Fucking A. It's good to be back up in Denton now. This is it. Over and done. And the free.